Hello and welcome to the tutorial section of the Forest Ecosystem Monitoring Cooperative Portal. In this tutorial, we will be going over how to add a project location. Starting from the home page, click on your account to get to the dashboard. Click on the Manage Projects and Datasets button. From here, select a project that you would like to add a project location to. Click on the Edit Project Information tab. This will redirect you to the Manage Project Information page. You will find the project location map at the bottom right of the page. If you already have the project locations input into the project, you will see the locations within the interactive map. If you haven't input data into the project, the interactive map will remain blank. To add the data, you will click the Change Project Site Location link under the interactive map. This will bring you to the Project Site Location Management page. This will then provide you with some options. You can use current association. This means that any location that you add will be added to the list of the sites that the project is associated with. For example, I have two study sites already drawn. Adding a new one will simply append to the list of sites for this project. You can also use an existing site or duplicate an existing site. Today we are going to focus on creating a new site. To begin, select the New Site tab. Enter the name of the location list. Then you can either upload a file or draw the locations of the site on a map. We are going to draw the site location. To begin drawing, select the Add New button. If you hover your mouse towards the top right corner of the map, you will be able to select various drawing tools. Clicking and holding the map will allow you to maneuver around the map to find your location. Scrolling the mouse wheel will allow you to zoom in and out. To use the polygon tool, you will click and drag your mouse around the outline of your site. While drawing, if you make a mistake, double click wherever you are to close the polygon. When you continue drawing a new polygon, the old one will be erased. You will then be required to enter how the location is coded. You can also add a longer description if needed. Once you have completed your drawing and filled out the necessary information, click Submit to save your new site location. You can then edit your sites if need be. Now we will add new locations by downloading a list. If you choose to use the Upload File feature, you will be prompted to upload an ArcMap Shapefile Zip Archive or a CSV, comma, delimited version of your lat longs. If you choose to use a CSV of lat longs feature, you will be required to upload CSV formatted as shown on the screen. Or you can download a template and plug your lat longs into the sheet. These points can then be easily uploaded into the project. 